Arcane enter the Undercity. This city was founded to be a bastion of enlightenment. We are the city of progress, and our future is bright. We were once one tribe. Now, we are houses divided. Hey there, geeks. So I had an opportunity to go to the Arcane League of Legends entering the Undercity. It was this really cool, I mean, is it weird to say underground event in the middle of Los Angeles? And I have to say, this part of town definitely resembled Zahn. We were nowhere near Melrose if you're catching my drift. It's like you're being submerged into the world itself. Now I do have to warn you, this event is rated R and is definitely not for children. And while there's nothing sexually explicit in it, there's a lot of foul language and generally just a lot that isn't for children. And my second warning, and it was one that we were not aware of, maybe we just didn't read the fine print, but there is no filming inside. It is 100% secretive. And in fact, they actually, like at some of our other events, we'll take our phones and stick them into a sealed device and you don't get them unsealed until after the event. So all of these photos that you're gonna see and parts of the video are things that were shot after the event was fully concluded and we were able to get our phones unlocked and finally take some images of the inside. But I do wanna explain a couple of fun things that happened before, during and after that I think are gonna really excite you for this event. So before you even get to the event, you're given an entire backstory. Mine was that my name was Silver, I was part of the Pleasure Crew, and our colors were turquoise. So right when you get to the Undercity, the action immediately happens. They had peacekeepers from Piltover waiting in line and really getting into character. We automatically felt like we were in the world of Arcane. But after about 15 minutes, we were ushered inside, and who's the first person that we see but Marcus? letting us know all of the rules that we're going to be experiencing once we headed inside. And the actor who played Marcus was phenomenal. They truly transformed this entire warehouse into Arcade. And after we cross the bridge, there's an amazing scene that I think you guys are all really going to appreciate with Vi and with Powder. And from there, the world just goes crazy. <laughs> and met our team leader. Or rather, he found us. Our colors helped. And I'll remind you, we were turquoise. So all of us in our group who were wearing turquoise were immediately scouted out and sent on various missions. And I wanna be very clear. There is absolutely no way that you're gonna be able to get everything done in one sitting. I myself started off with one crew, ended off with another crew, accidentally killed someone. That was kind of crazy. It was just, there was too much. There was too much to do. There was too much to see. They really jam pack all of these mini adventures while trying to succeed in the bigger mission that is Arcane. And it's just amazing. If you get the opportunity, I implore you to go, especially if you like League of Legends and definitely if you like League of Legends Arcane, there is something there for you, I promise. They also have drinks if you're 21 and up, some food and some merch. For the absolute best time at the Arcane Undercity, make sure you watch all nine episodes of Arcane League of Legends out on Netflix now, and I'll see you guys for the next adventure.